Hi, Scissoring here, and I just wanted to make a super quick, super simple video about how I made my new shield. Now, as you can see, this is really good. It has plus four uh, to one res, and this is specifically good with the new melding of flesh. What this does is it equalizes your max res. So if you're able to get a 90 max fire res, you have 90 max all res. So this is really, really good. So I wanted to make a quick video. It's pretty easy, really, with how I've made all these shields. So basically, I have like I've had a lot of these. So I've also been annulling them. So I think I've bricked like six or seven. And just the fact that I've had around 10 on Hardcore SSF in not that many rock champs is pretty telling how easy it is. So this is one of the pretty... Uh, I'll keep this just... It already has life, so I don't need to waste exalts on getting life as a prefix. Because all you need is the suffixes. After that, you can use harvest with a keep suffixes, reforge prefixes. And then you have... Um, that you can't use the new Eldritch currencies because you can't influence the shields in that way. But you can use... Um, Suffixes cannot be changed and reforge life to fix the prefix later. I have a couple others as well. Here is another. Uh, this is plus four lightning. This one is plus five lightning and plus four cold, whatever I feel like. I guess I kind of would want to annul that. Uh, this one is plus five lightning, plus one fire, and 84 lightning damage. Um, so like we've we've made a couple of really, really good things, and it that, I've actually been Spamming expedition for 30 minutes, but I don't have the nodes. I haven't actually managed to get any rog. I've gotten all the other ones, but I do have a shield. Um, and all you want is this, but with suffixes. So this one, this already has fine prefixes. We can skip that. Uh, you also will benefit a lot from upgrading the modifiers. But what you're really looking for. Okay, well, you don't really want that. There, this is what you're looking for. And boom. There you see how easy it is. Now we're looking for this one that we got here. Upgrade the level of three modifiers. And now the lightning rest is going to go up a level. And we have a really, really good shield. Now, sadly, this does not have suppression. And sadly, I am sitting in front of the tooltip. But uh, we made plus three max res on lightning, plus three chaos res, and plus two all maximum res. And my editor is going to yell at me for being in front of the tooltip. But uh, this is a pretty good shield and uh, we can upgrade it further. This is going to upgrade the hybrid life and the life or sadly maybe the evasion. Actually, it will it will upgrade the evasion. So it'll just upgrade all the prefixes. Now, most of the builds I'm going to be doing this, I don't have a reason to have Chaos Rest. So while it looks really cool, it actually isn't really beneficial. You're an investor, or, um, honestly, that's not the worst idea to open up a prefix to craft something neat but do i want it that's tempting open prefix to craft to be fair i'd rather have an open suffix to craft and remove the chaos rest so i probably would risk annulling this um so since i don't want to craft a prefix and a suffix i'm probably going to skip but either way there you have it so you're basically just looking to have three suffixes on the shield and then you're looking for like the reroll 10 times. I don't know why we get it so much. It's probably like it is the highest item level modifier probably. But it is crazy because I've never found it that much on rolling random shields. Even if I did re roll 10 times. I don't know. Rog is just crazy good for shields. And uh, like what I just did was not a very uncommon feat. I made so many of these and I didn't have that many rogs. So I was generally trying to roll specifically on shields that could roll spell suppression. But I was also rolling on fossilized spare shields, just trying to get really beefy, you know, like plus one fire, 100 fire damage, 100 life shields uh, with the max res. But uh, yeah, if you can't get an Aegis Aurora, get yourself one of these shields. They're very, very easy and you can do basically the same build. They're just slightly less tanky as this. So pretty cool shield and I just wanted to make a quick video about it. Rog is in fact Rog Champ. So thanks for watching. Hope you help. Hope, hope the video helps you. Um, thanks for watching and sub if you liked the video, but more importantly, try to die less than I do.